Hi, I'm Stavros. Good morning and welcome to Enniscorthy in County Wexford in Ireland. I'm here for the Gerd Murphy Memorial Run that's taking place here at the Mart. It will set off on their big run around County Wexford and then finishing off back here later on today. So it's very early here in the morning. It's just gone 8 a.m. We have a couple of arrivals here at the moment. We have Tesla with two cars there just pulling in and we're waiting for hundreds of more cars so there'll be classic cars vintage cars and modern cars as we have with the two teslas so yeah everybody is just setting up here at the moment we've got a big tent down there and it's all going to kick off here in a few hours time from ennis gorthy here so do stick with us a lot of cars to show you in this video So here at the moment we have a 1972 Ford Capri over there in yellow and this Ford Cortina in orange here, the GXL. That is your two classic Fords. But I just want to walk over here and show you this lifting equipment from Fink Biner. This is mobile lifting equipment for your garage. So you're not stuck with your lifting equipment in one spot in your garage you can see the way all these legs are mobile you just wheel them around your garage and each of them can lift seven and a half ton for a total lifting capacity of 30 ton so i really like the idea of being able to move them around your garage and you charge them up and they're lifted electrically and you just wheel them around with a the handle there they're easy enough to swing around they're only about 500 kilos in weight each leg but uh yeah you lift up trucks and buses and no problem at all to lift this small little light Isuzu truck. But well, that is very handy lifting equipment from Fink Biner. Okay, I'm just hiding under this umbrella guys. The rain is coming down, but look who has arrived! Ian Cummins in his Mazda Unas. Check this out, Ian! You're all the way down from the north of Ireland. Yes, Stavros. <laughs> um, how did you get drive down, okay? Oh, good time. I came down yesterday, stayed yeah. here last night, staying at B&B just out the road there, so very, very, very nice. <laughs> now, Ian, how many hours are you going to be cleaning the car? <laughs> well, it's a good question. It's, Three minimum, I'd say. I huh? would say I'll be cleaning all morning. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's just a wee bit damp, you know, yeah. so. But hopefully and I can get it uh, yeah. all cleaned up, you know, for the road run at 1 o'clock. So yeah, it's all going to kick off at 1 p.m. Yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> so Ian, best of luck. Okay. And I, I let you to it. You have a lot of work to do. Yes. Thanks, Doris. <laughs> Seriously. Good to see you. No problem, man. No problem. There he goes in the Mazda Unos there, guys. <laughs> Check this out, guys. We have a 1989 Toyota Celica replica here. Rally car. So it would have been the Group N of its day. <laughs> but look at the work on this on the inside to get it as much as possible to the original car, the look of the original car. So absolutely fantastic work on this car. Uh, the uh, Toyota Celica replica rally car. You can see on the door there, Rally Monte Carlo. <laughs> Yeah, I really do like this, guys. What do you think? Do you want one? <laughs> Is it for sale? <laughs> no. At the right money. At the right money. It could be yours, guys. <laughs> the 89 Celica. And this is the car that will be given away today, guys. It's a 1992 Volkswagen Golf GTI Mark III. So one of the lucky participants here today taking part in the run will be winning this car so that is a very good thing if you uh, if you're lucky enough to win it so let's take a look around some of the cars that have arrived here now so we have this mini estate 1979 and beside it Ian's car he has spent about two hours so far cleaning the car. Ian, I think you missed a bit there, look. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, Ian's uh, MX-5 Bluebird 
Um, let's have a walk around here and I'll show you. We have a Celica Turbo there, four-wheel drive, 1990. Lancia HF Delta Integrale there. So that car, probably 30, 35,000 euro. Value is worth on that. Very nice car. <laughs> then this 380 SEC. Mercedes as well. Very good car. Very, I like them a lot, those. <laughs> and the 5 Series there. 1985. And the Toyota Soarer there. 1990. Coupe there. Looking very well. And the Vauxhall Viva. <laughs> 1973. And the Nissan Skyline there as well, 1993. The 92 300ZX Nissan there. And the MX3 V6, 1998. And the Renault 5 there. Uh, check out the interior of this Renault 5. <laughs> Pretty wild <laughs> interior. Great work done to that car. It looks really well. I like that. 1987. And move here to our Nissan 350Z 2004. Honda Prelude. Porsche Carrera. BMW M3 2001. And another Nissan there. Toyota Corolla, of course. XLI 1997 and that Volvo convertible yeah so we just have a quick walk down here because there are plenty of Fords down there great showing of Fords here as well we have the ST Fiesta ST Focus Mark II Ford Escorts more Focuses and down here we have all the classics Mark II Ford Escorts there the RS2000, the Harrier, the green one there, looking fantastic. And another RS2000 there, 1978. And Ford Capris here, great selection of Ford Capris. Let me just show you this one though, with the genuine Irish registration. That is a Limerick registration. It's a 1973 Ford Capri. You can see the letters before the numbers. And then in the 80s, it went to the numbers before the letters. So that is a Cork registration on this 1982 Ford Fiesta. So they're the only registrations to have, guys. The genuine Irish registrations. That is just something I love on those old classics. But there you go, your 1973 Ford Capri. And the arrival of another Capri there. And is this an RS Sierra Cosworth? Is it? Is it? Is it? <laughs> it actually is, guys. And Mr. Brady has arrived with three Scanias here. So we have an R500, an R series, which I don't know which it is because it's not marked. And then we have the R560 V8 there. So they are the trucks. Hopefully we'll have some more trucks arriving in a while. <laughs> all right, lads. In the red Capri. It's starting to get busy here now, guys. They're all starting to arrive. The Toyota AE86. And another Ford Sierra RS Cosworth there. Uh, very nice car, them, guys. The RS Cosworth 1992, that model there. And another AE86. And the Toyota Supra there, the black one. And we even have a Ford Fiesta there, guys. <laughs> but uh, where is that 2 Oh, there it is, hiding behind the Ford Fiesta. Look at this 2002 here. Yeah. This is nice now, this is nice. I must ask him what year it is. What, what year is your 2002? 73. 73, guys. There you go. Look at this. Yeah, the prices of these are going up. And it has the round lights at the back, guys. That's the one you want. Uh, of course, a turbo would be nice, but these are very nice. Mazda MX-5 pulling in. 
Is he going to pull up beside Ian? He probably is. Maybe, maybe, maybe. <laughs> yeah, I think so. But yeah, it's getting busy here now, guys. With cars pulling in. Look at this. Great selection now pulling in here, guys. And we have the arrival of some more trucks here. So we have the Iveco Stralis there from Gethings Garage. And check out this Hino here. 1990, 27 years old <laughs> on this SH28. I really like that now. Let's just have a look around the rear of it there. And the alloy wheels as well. And nice painting on the side of it there. Just have a look inside, guys. There you go. <laughs> The old Hino. 28 years of age. Absolutely incredible condition here. And the painting there at the back as well. Great piece of work. And the exhaust pipes as well. The stack. Oh yeah, I really do like that. And let's just have a look out here. They have their other Iveco Stralis here. 430 horsepower. And we have Breen Transport there beside them with a string of trucks as well. More Iveco Stralis and Mercedes Actress. And down here we have a couple of more arrivals there the MAN and the R Series Scania and the Renault Magnum there as well. So just some of the trucks here that are also taking part in the run. So great to see the support from the owners of the trucks coming out and taking part in the run. for a Ford Escort 97 out of insurance, out of tax, out of NCT, but it has everything else. Right, there we go, right, the key is here, 320 euros, going three times. It's going, it's going, and it's gone to this man over here, fair play to you, good man yourself. So what do you think guys, 320 euro for this <laughs> 97 Ford Escort estate, and uh, the rust comes for free guys. Yeah, that's free rust there for you. And the tow hitch as well. That might be worth about 20 euro. Yeah, so uh, let's have a look inside. Let's have a look inside the classic uh, Ford Escort there, guys. Yeah, lovely fake wood on the dashboard there as well. Plenty of wear on this car. What mileage on it, guys? <laughs> what, what genuine mileage would be the question. <laughs> but uh, yeah, the Gia badge there might be worth a few bob as well. But uh, that's it, your 97 Ford Escort for 320 euro, <laughs> sold. So we've got an absolutely incredible selection of Fords here. Classics from all decades here, guys. It's absolutely fantastic to see. But uh, if I were to pick one car from the show to take away today, guys, my favorite car of the show, it would have to be <laughs> the Ford Granada 1975. I absolutely love this car. So I'm going to give it to that, guys. The 1975 Four Granada Coupe with the genuine Dublin Irish registration. That, to me, is the star of the show. Yeah, so we don't have long now before they'll all set off here from the start line of the Gerard Murphy Memorial Run and I'll be taking part in Ian Cummins Mazda MX-5. So myself and Ian will be taking part in the run. So I'm looking forward to showing you how it all goes because <laughs> I wasn't in the run last year. Uh, yeah, so we'll get set up here 
and then it's all go. Four, Here we go, three, it's all gonna start. Two, one, and let them go. Let the balloons go. <laughs> We're battling our way out. <laughs> it's a bit of hectic at the moment. There's cars from all angles here, guys, trying to get out. We've the Mark II Escort behind us. And oh, a Jag S type in front of us. 99. <laughs> there you go, guys. Let's hit the road. Here we go. <laughs> down through some of the places we're going to <laughs> so we're going into Ballindagan uh, what's this Kiltili, Ballymurphy, Boris, up to Fina I think we're a half an hour stay in Fina Ian is it? <laughs> and uh, then we're going to Michel, uh, Kildavan, Bunclody, Ballycarney, uh, Scarra Walsh and then back into and it's Gordy, guys, okay? So we've got the 85 Sierra behind us and the Celica behind him. Yeah! here in Fina at the moment this is the halfway mark roughly <laughs> and we'll be parked here for about a half an hour before we all set off again but there they are all in the line and all the way up here as well <laughs> quite a sight to see the 1994 Toyota Cresta Japanese import a Tourer V ahead of us there guys so yeah they're all just turning right here and we'll make our way back to Ennis Gorthy That's where it all started this morning and we have a Toyota MR2 behind us there. <laughs> so Ian you enjoyed it yeah? Love it. Brilliant. Brilliant. <laughs> Great fun here and luckily enough the weather held up. So what more could you want? Open top motoring. 
Oh, lads! <laughs> I heard them roaring there. But yeah, that's how it all went, guys. We're back. back it's just gone 4 p.m. now so about two and a half hours out on this run <laughs> an enjoyable run though guys and hundreds of cars taking part and they're still arriving at the moment an old Fiat here and another Mazda MX-5 and an E30 BMW there so lovely selection of cars <laughs> Morris Minor taking part and guy oh look we have the guy here from last year he, who never, who never won the Capri? Am I going to win the Escort? <laughs> Fair play. <laughs> yeah. And uh, yeah, check out this Morris Minor there, look. Nice Morris Minor estate. All that wood on the back window there. Look at it, look. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Huh? Nice Irish registration as well on that one, guys. So yeah, that's how it all looks here. Uh, Jaguar. Check out the Jag, E-Type Jag. What year is the Jag E-Type? This one, 72. 72, there you go guys, 72. E-Type Jag, V12 that one. Yeah, V12. And the MG here as well. So yeah, they're still arriving here. Probably will be for another while. And, that, and then it's the prize giving. <laughs> All the prizes being given out on stage here as well. So yeah, we'll see has Ian won anything? Probably not, who knows, who knows guys? But yeah, you can just see the line of them there, all still arriving, yeah. Yeah, great fun, great fun guys. <laughs> I've never even seen this earlier on, it's from 1961, check this out. <laughs> that is a wild car there guys <laughs> look at the bonnet the scoop there wow prize guys check it out look <laughs> best convertible at the show Ian well done man <laughs> fair play <laughs> yeah. so well worth a trip from the north of Ireland Ian's won that <laughs> That's what we like to see guys, plenty of dirt. A well used Capri, fair play. <laughs> And there he goes, <laughs> the 1977 Mark 1 Fiat 127. Fantastic condition there as well. So that's it guys, I'm going to wrap it up today. Mark 2 Ford Escort. <laughs> yeah. And that's it, the prizes have been given out and that's everything done and dusted for another year from the Gerard Murphy Memorial Charity Car Run, guys. I really had a great time. So I do hope you enjoyed the video and until the next video, which will come up next weekend, I'll talk to you then, guys. But thank you all for watching now. 
I'm gonna chat to again soon, guys. <laughs> Cheers! <laughs>